I haven't told them about the wedding yet because I'm worried about their reactions. So basically, I'm gonna get married. You can tell me. Hello everyone, if you guys are new, hit the subscribe button down below and join the channel. So if you guys don't know, Gyu had to go back to his state to fix his birth certificate and change it from female to male so that he can marry Isabel. However, he hasn't told his family that he's going to be marrying Isabel until now. Let's go ahead and take a look. So what happened was is that I had to fix my birth certificate because it still said female. For what? I'm going to get married. You can tell me. If you propose? Yes. Wow, what are you didn't tell us. Yeah, you didn't tell us. So they didn't seem too happy about it, but after hearing this history, it kind of makes sense as to why she reacted that way. It kind of hurt, like... I'm gonna get emotional. It kind of hurts because, from my point of view, me and Gabe are best friends, and the fact that Gabe is hiding his proposal from me makes me feel as though he doesn't value our relationship. Obviously, I love him so much and I want to be there for him and I want to be a part of it. And then the mom ends up saying this. My son's marrying a woman that I've never met before. I do have worries and concerns. I want to make sure if I'm losing my son to her that she is the right person. We do see though that they are in a way accepting of her. We're both super excited about it. We're happy for you. Happy for you if you have genuinely found someone that you love and that's there for you. She will defend me to the Good. end of the earth. Yeah. Good. Nobody talks to her in a rude or disrespect. Good. People are they afraid know. of her. They they <laughs> and then a prenup gets mentioned in the conversation. Because I don't know if there's any type of like Colombian prenup, but are you doing that or just in case? Just in case it doesn't work out. But I feel like once you get a prenup, then it's like, I feel like setting it up for failure. More of like an insurance policy. It's a protection plan. Honestly, I don't want to have that conversation. We also do see that the sister brings up the prenup once again, but she does give her reasons as to why she is very insistent about it. Have you decided on the um, prenup situation? for women that are very needy, very jealous, and a little stupid. And he's worked very hard throughout all of his life to build up his business. And I would hate to see someone take it from him. However, Gabe has made it very clear that he will not be doing a prenup. You gonna do it? No. Whew, stupid. <laughs> Monica is being a little pushy when she's like insisting on we get a prenup, but I feel like she just doesn't understand how I feel. Okay, so on the next episode, we see that Isabel and her sister finally meet up. You kind of have us under the impression that she's very controlling and very jealous. She's overstepping to where it's like only hurting me. I'm very overprotective of Gabe. And so we want to know that he's taken care of while he's in Colombia. I don't think the sister is being rude about the situation. If anything, I think she just simply worries about her brother. And that's not a bad thing. But do you guys think that what Gabe said is true? That she's overstepping? Let me know down below. And as always, I will see you guys on the next one. Bye.